नमस्ते फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू एग्री एनालाइज दिस वीडियो इज ऑल अबाउट फिनोटाइपिक पाथ एनालिसिस यूजिंग एग्री एनालाइज प्लेटफॉर्म फिनोटाइपिक पाथ एनालिसिस इज जनरली डन बाय द रिसर्चर्स ऑफ जेनेटिक्स एंड प्लान ब्रीडिंग दिस इज द आउटपुट फ्रॉम द एग्री एनालाइज प्लेटफॉर्म ऑन द डायगनल एलिमेंट वी हैव डायरेक्ट इफेक्ट ऑल द ऑफ डायगनल एलिमेंट्स ऑफ दिस मैट्रिक्स are the indirect effects and in last we have the phenotypic correlation of the dependent variable here we have kept grain yield as a dependent variable with that of the independent variables there is also one trick to check if the analysis is correct or not so that trick is sum of all the direct and indirect effect must be equal to the correlation value because path analysis is basically breaking the correlation into direct and indirect effect let's sum this up so you can see this sum of the direct and indirect effects is equal to the correlation of the grain yield with this trait also it will write the interpretation of the result so the second output will be this pdf file first it will talk about the residual value so the residual value and its interpretation and then trait by trait it will comment on the direct and indirect effect of the independent variables on the chosen dependent variables let's see how to arrange the data so the experiment must be conducted in randomized complete block design and data can be arranged like this in a csv file first you can place your genotypes followed by replication and then your trait so i am also sharing this file in the description box you can check it out later and arrange your data accordingly here you can first have like we have 40 genotypes so first you can write like this genotype 1 genotype 1 genotype 1 then followed by replication 1 2 3 if you have four replication write genotype 1 four times and replication 1 2 4 and then corresponding data or you can also write like this that you can write genotype 1 to 40 and then write 40 times r1 then again write genotype 1 to 40 and again write r2 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 40 times and so on it's entirely dependent on you okay let's jump to the platform so while entering on this website you need to first do your registration by giving your cell phone number and gmail id it will register the user once verification has been done so in this there is this option of analytical tool in analytical tool we have dedicated option of genetics and plant breeding this video is about phenotypic path analysis so let's choose the phenotypic path analysis during the analysis let's say if you get stuck somewhere or you have any type of doubts or questions then just click on this need help button this will directly connect you with me and you can ask your questions on whatsapp so first step is choosing the file i am selecting the file that i have shown to you then second step is choosing the genotypes after that select the column that contain the replication then choose the dependent variable generally researchers keep yield trait as a dependent variable here grain yield is my yield trait after that you can see all the rest of the variables or columns has been chosen as a independent variables after that click on the submit once you click on the submit it will give you the basic idea about your data set so our data set contains 40 genotypes number of replications are 3 our dependent variable chosen is grain yield and total observations are 
120 that is 40 multiplied by 3 that is 120 and we have 8 independent variables currently this research is free and because the website is under development soon there will be some nominal fee for that now click on the submit button once you click on the submit button you can see the download option click on this download and give the name proper name let's see so this is the output that is the interpretation of the results and second file that I'm getting in the zip is the analysis this file will contain the metrics of direct and indirect effect along with the correlation of the chosen dependent variable with the rest of the independent variables if you have any type of questions regarding this analysis or methodology feel free to connect with me my whatsapp number is in the description box hope you find this video useful thank you for watching this out